Good. Okay. Sammy. Okay, go ahead, Sammy. Uh, a, a couple of questions, and I've been asking them for years. I'll ask it again. Just uh, the first thing is on your steps there, making it uh, ten bushels statewide. I guess you said hand harvest is on your objectives. Mm -hmm. I would have a big issue with that, uh, at least from Highway 58 bridge down, because at five bushels right now, they've about destroyed every rock that there is. Uh, I think Stephen can tell you as well as anybody, I've worked real close with him. I've marked a lot of sites where we put shells and had tremendous results with them. And then those guys come right in there and after we let them start oystering there in two years, they take the rock off with them. So uh, my other thing I would like to see y'all look into is a greater cull tolerance. You, you know, I know they can't do it up where they do the oyster dredges, so maybe below the 58 bridge. Um, I think that needs to be done. And uh, the other thing, I have a, a big concern with the $35 shellfish license, and I always have had. Y'all have heard me say it before. Uh, it's a tool that guys use below the 58 bridge to collect unemployment and oyster at the same time. And then they go to the oyster houses down south, and they walk in there and go, you know what, we're willing to sell our stuff for whatever you want to give me cash as long as it's cash and it becomes a way that the guys that are out there making their living you know and a lot of the older gentlemen are the ones that <coughs> make their living in our area doing that now and then they come in expecting thirty dollars a bushel and they only get twenty because you've got a guy out there that's a plumber or a, i think you can go to scotts hill marina and look at the trucks electricians plumbers i mean i've had steven go there and look and I don't understand why you can have a $35 oyster license and sell oysters, but you can't sell anything else in this state without a standard endorsement. That's always baffled me. Um, and that's kind of, you know, that, that's my thoughts on it. And, and But the thing I'll dislike the most is trying to increase at least below the 58 bridge to 10 bushels a day. I think, I, I, I don't have to tell Stephen, he knows. I, it would devastate us down there. Those are all good points, Sammy, and we've taken them down, and we'll consider those when we develop those issues. Thank you.